Hello and welcome. I'm Rich Slate, and joining me is Andrew Guy. And Andrew, this is going to be a stressful couple of days for these competitors. <laughs> That's right, man. 32 of the best players in the world that don't have that golden ticket are going to be facing off here at our last chance qualifier. Every single match, we send someone home with the paycheck, and then the other person gets to live for maybe just one more day. And it looks like he'll survive, but look at all that damage on the left. It only takes one push. Yeah, he has to be careful, has to play it's the Mother Witch at the bridge, and I think he should be good. Snowball coming down, plus the poison. Lightning NATO shouldn't be enough. Wow. That, that is uh, Pompeo <laughs> making it through on spells two times in a row. Incredibly close in a game that I thought was almost over. EQ in on one side, Fireball on the other, 246 remaining. Does Dark Angel go Graveyard one more time on the left-hand side, or does he play defense? Hog trying to sneak on through, Snowball puts some more damage. 470 is the mark, EQ not going to be enough here. Dark Angel takes the win in game number three and is going on through to tomorrow. Brad wreaking havoc on both sides here. Eric has already called GG, and that is going to do it. Brad moves on. The pro stays alive. He can see him celebrating. Oh, okay, it's spell cycle. I'm done. This is one to stay in the game. And you see Benzer right now happy to switch lanes and again put up some pretty significant damage. But look at that damage on the left-hand tower now, down to 226. Yo, my oh, boy. God. Wow. What a play from Schwarzen. 10 HP separating these two as we go into our final 12 seconds. Wow, really like how he plays that. Zap should be enough to get the Fisherman, but no, doesn't place the Zap on top of the Fisherman, and he's not gonna be able to defend the RG. Keith is gonna win this. Oh my word. Yeah, and I'm surprised we didn't see maybe even a high Inferno out of Lapo just to try to move it around, make those lightnings a little bit Ooh. less value. And Lapo does go for a great lightning block with 1267 remaining on the tower. Uh, a miracle will need to come down for him to still win this game. He has to, he should, oh, he might have wanted to barrel defensively there. The lightning comes in, damage on tower, and Lapo furious. Man, that was a crazy game of cat and mouse. Gold is so susceptible to like an easy defense where you clean everything up with just one spell. And so that was a huge hit there. He's giving up a lot of damage. But look at the left side. What a gamble here from Vitor. Oh. And he throws the chips on the table, goes all in, and gets a huge win. Let's see if he goes high Tesla here. And he's oh, late with he's the, Tesla. the Tesla. He's and late with the it. Tesla. Oh my god, 44 HP remains. Log comes in. Boss just needs to get damage on the tower. 66 HP in. Oh my goodness, Rich. That is some of the craziest gameplay I have ever seen. There's the Miner plus the Poison going to take the guards out of play. Now something else needs to come down to catch the Cannon Cart. An overspend from Ale. And it looks like the Frenchman will move on to tomorrow. You gotta go minor guards, poison maybe here. Anything to beat out that cycle. Miner goes to the back, poison in. Delivery comes down to take care of the miner, and yeah, that's a GG well played. Good opportunity for Ale. Hugo, though, says you'll get one bit of luck, but no extra from me. What would you do if I told you the next three games of Clash Royale might change your life? $5,000 right now, 15 k guaranteed, and a shot at Clash Royale League World Finals and a grand prize worth over $200,000. Well, for 16 players today, that's the truth. That's the life that they're living right now, and you're going to watch it right here with us. Trouble to keep up with that cycle in, in regards to ground units. Oh. After that, wow, and Pompeo! Pompeo has been eliminated. That's the most important card to get back around to. So is the Mother Witch. Both of them coming out early means hopefully to deal with the balloon. Both of them should be back in, but balloon already down on the board. I believe he should be back around to a Mega Minion. There it is, but minor in. Yeah, those arrows are just putting in so much work right there. Wow. Game over, Rad celebrating. Poison does finally come down for Dark Angel, but feels like too little too late. Yeah. Lightning will keep things more firm for Chief Keef, and there wow. you have it. Chief Keef going to Clash Royale League World Finals. And when you have one best of three with everything riding on it, it's very important to get your matchups right. And get it right, he did. Hajime. 
getting paid off correctly. The hard work coming through big. He will be going all the way to Clash Royale League World Finals. It's going to be a log and it's going to be an earthquake. And as long as he can defend this, he'll be okay. Uh oh. Delivery coming down on top of the hogs with the log. That will be. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Will be enough. It will not be enough. He misses. And right now, over. Just going to put it this pedal it. to the metal. E Giant at the bridge. And yep. there it is. There's the lightning. Wow. That is a huge lightning. And the build up behind Mega Minion will get on tower here. The NATO oh, to no. pull everything back. That was beautiful. And Eric, that might be the game. I am more nervous than they are. And it seems like it is Golden Gold. That's it. That is it. GG, well played. We have Colombia in the World Finals. Spawners all up for Ian, no spawners up for Bob. So this is where it gets a little tricky. Only 15 seconds remain, down to 10. Bob the Rock just needs to hold on for dear oh life as his cannon card is trying to break on through. The E-Barbs come down, Royal That's Delivery it. up high. That is going to do it. Bob the Rock from the Netherlands is going on to World Finals. He has to get that log oh down. Two HP. Oh my <laughs> word! The Coca RX is one oh, earthquake away. A nice high mortar. Can he get it done? Barrel in. Archie on the Where's tower. The earthquake? Can Vitor Where's steal the it? Time. Vitor oh steals it by 44 goodness. HP. He's going to CRL World Finals. It's there, but minor damage in on the opposite side of the board. That loon isn't going to get pulled. That oh, loon is wow. not going to get pulled. Rich Framcito is going to World Finals. Oh, wow. There are the Elite Eight that were able to play through two days of single elimination, best of threes. They're going to World Finals, Rich.